So this is Nation Builder, and uh, we're going to edit the two global sidebars. Um, I've already created my custom theme. If you haven't done that, follow the instructions on the tutorial. They're really simple, and it'll spit you out here. Um, our main column, our main sidebar, is in this Columns Two template, and this uh, this is the sidebar that's shown to people users that are not logged in. So you say in this liquid language, they have if the user is not is logged in, then show them the supporter nav, and that's the navigation that you see in the sidebar when you're logged in. Um, looks like this. And so if they're not logged in, then oops, I added this, but it'll show call out and then the rest of the sidebar. So this is where you can get in and make some changes. I've added div custom sidebar item and div uh, out right under the else, so it doesn't show up in my logged in sidebar, but I've got it up in Safari where I'm not logged in, and you can see right here on top of the sidebar, you can see my custom sidebar item. Um, and so if you go into pages, and we're gonna go back to our theme, click on theme, and then it takes you back here. We're gonna scroll a little bit farther down and we're going to work with supporter nav. This is the navigation that shows when you are logged in. So we have a lot more liquid language here, and this is dealing with different user roles. So for instance, if the user is an intern, they have a different sidebar than someone who's not an intern. Um, and then what we're looking for is this ndiff div class supporter nav container uh, list class supporter nav. And I'm going to edit right here, and I'm going to add something that says, oops, let's do div and custom sidebar and div. There we go. And this built-in text editor is really nice. It tells you when your HTML is messed up. So save and publish. And then we'll come here and we'll refresh. There we go. And so you can see this custom sidebar is here. And we can move where it is somewhat. Um, you can see that if I go back to, here's my, here's what I just added, the custom sidebar. Um, I can add it I can put it under um, inside the supporter navigation. Um, that's right here in these lists here. And so that's, uh, you know, you can mess around, you can play around with it and get more comfortable, uh, you know, adding things in different places. You can add an image, you can add just about anything you can think of um, to make your site really w work the way you want it to work.